okay what's up y'all so i want to say like um y'all know when i say it. okay so look, i'm gonna say this first of all um it went huh Yeah. Okay. okay, so what I was saying, so like, um, when I was when I did that reading earlier and I was talking about that masculine energy, um, let me try to speak up because I know I, I gotta give me a mic, y'all. I'm gonna give me a mic real soon. I be forgetting every time I say I'm gonna give me one, I never get one because I, you know, I just, it always just be on my mind like that. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to go ahead and, and make that happen for y'all because y'all saying y'all can't hear me and I don't, I'm just, I feel like I'm already loud, you know what I'm saying, loud enough. But, um, so yeah, so when I was talking about that masculine energy and I was saying people selling their soul, right? It is possible for you to get your life back, you know. So I'm not saying it's gonna be easy because I don't know what evil entity that you open, you know what I'm saying, that you opened up to, or whatever evil entity that you, you know, I don't know. But, um, you know, when you want out of things like that, when you're trying to change a new leaf, when you're trying to give it to God, you know, give your life to God, a lot of things start happening. You know what I'm saying? A lot of ugly things start happening. So, like, I don't know what you're going through, your situation, your story, or, like, what demon you open yourself up to or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because different demons have different powers, right? They're not all the same. So, if I was in, what I would tell you personally, you know what I'm saying, if I was in your shoes, what I would tell you is to just simply turn to God immediately. Like, immediately turn to God. I know somebody out there that right now that's watching me somewhere out there right now that you got a demon in you. Or, you know what I'm saying? Or, you know, you need to give your life to God. Or, you know, it's some things you got going on that, um, you know, you got to change. A lot of things you need to change. Some of y'all know y'all not living right. And you know, you know that you can do better. So, I would just simply say just turn immediately turn yourself to God, right? Get baptized or whatever you got to do. You know, make your confessions and you know, be sincere and you repent and, you know, read your Bible and do what you have to do. That's what I would say. Ask Christ to help you. That's what I would tell you. And I guarantee you that he will help you. So, with that being said, you know, I just feel like it's not too late. You know what I'm saying? It's not too late. For some, for some of y'all, it's not too late. You know who you are. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure this reading will touch somebody. You know who you are. You know you can you, you know you need to change before you head into you are already going towards destruction. You know what I'm saying? I've been there before. You know what I'm saying? I've never been an after type of person. I've never been a bad person. But you know, it's the people I hung around, I definitely could change. I definitely could let that go. You know what I'm saying? I have and I moved on. And guess what? Believe it or not, they still doing the same thing they were doing five years ago when I left them. Like, I ain't look back. You know what I'm saying? I done seen a couple of them and some of them speak and some of them I just snap my face up. What's up? You know what I'm saying? I speak, but it's, it's wrong. I'm gone the other way. You know what I'm saying? Like, I seen somebody today. They ain't say nothing to me. And a lot of people be intimidated by me. You know what I'm saying? Like, it didn't, the stupidest thing. They be thinking I can read that mind. That's the stupidest thing. Like, I don't look at you and just read your mind. I'm looking at your body movement. I'm looking at your eyes. And that through your eyes, I can damn near read your mind. But I'm the, I, I ain't just going to look at you and just, you know what I'm saying? But if you make eye, eye contact with me too long, oh, it's on, baby. It's on. It's on and popping, I guess you. So you already know what to do. Hold your motherfucking head down. <laughs> But I'm just saying, you know, it's not too late, y'all. It's never too late. And anyway, speaking of that, so the reading I'm finna do, I'm hearing this song. Who's that lady? Who's that lady? Real fine lady. Who's that? And I'm calling out to you because I'm doing it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Whoever, who's that? Who's that lady? Who, who's saying that song, y'all? I think it's the Adler Brothers, I want to say. I think it is. I think it is. But I'm hearing this song, so I'm getting like, who's that lady? People want to know who is the who the hell is that lady? Where she at? Who is that lady? I don't know whoever you are. I feel like people, you, you could be like popular. I don't know. People know you or I don't know. Maybe when you out. And what's up to, um, what's up to you? Shout out to you. Uh, you know who you are. I seen you yesterday at the store and you was like, hey, don't I know you from uh, YouTube? Shout out to you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. And I appreciate you for your support as well. Oh y'all really I appreciate everybody who's watching, who tune in when I, you know, be doing my little readings or whatever. But you know, or whatever. But you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so people wanna know like 
who's that lady? People want to know who the hell is that lady. Like, I don't know. And then I've been getting like, people like, damn, that's a, you a psychic? It's like, whatever your past is, whoever you are now, people don't, people looking at you like, that person a what? They a psychic. They a who? They did what? I'm telling you, people want to know who the hell are you or where, where the hell she is. Where, where you at? You know what I'm saying? Everybody want to know who who's that lady. Everybody want to know who's that lady. I'm telling you. Uh, they can't believe that you a psychic or it, they can't believe that you doing something. It's something you doing or something you saying that you want. Like maybe back then, you know, when you was hanging around all these people that didn't mean you no good. You know what I'm saying? The people who can't go with you. You know what I'm saying? On your journey. It, I feel like you was somebody different. Maybe you was the type of person who didn't speak up or speak out a lot. Or <clears throat> people thought you was just too naive. Or you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, she ain't going to say nothing. She going to keep letting me do it. Or he ain't going to say nothing. He going to keep letting me do it. Because I could be talking about a man too. I ain't got to be talking about a woman. You know what I'm saying? But that's the energy I'm getting like. Thinking you a sucker. You know what I'm saying? Sucker bust the whole trust. That's, the, that's what they think you is. But you nothing like that in reality. You know what I'm saying? It's like somebody brought that monster out of you. You know what I'm saying? You keep on pinching the motherfucker, keep fucking with them. They gon' you gon' they gon' end up turning on you. You know what I'm saying? And that's what you did. But it's like you did it in a nice, nasty kind of way. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna do this shit nice, nasty. I ain't finna do it like y'all do it, but I'm gonna do it nice, nasty, so you gonna be able to feel me. That's that's what I'm getting. So let's see. Mm. And I'm still hearing it in my head. Who's that? Let me see. Let me see what people think of you. You are so beautiful. So people think you're very beautiful. Okay. And they said, "Why do you need me?" So people feel like, um, she, you beautiful. Like, um, she's too beautiful. She may be too good for me. She don't need me. Then why do you? In their head, it's like, why do you need me? Why does she need me? She don't need me for nothing. She got everything, or he has everything. You know what I'm saying? They think of you as, as somebody who, like, thinks before they act, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, you know, don't react on bullshit or it's like, uh, people trying to turn on you or do certain things so you thinking they gonna get a reaction out of you, but you somebody who think before you act, you know what I'm saying? They thinking, or they mad because they can't get a reaction out of you, but their car they fell here was, um, I dream about you a lot too much. So somebody definitely thinking about you, dreaming about you, thinking about you, um, I heard that song. Uh, um, hoping and praying. Hey, what's the name of that song? Dreaming and hoping and praying. I can't think of the song, y'all. I don't know, but anyway, that's the only part I can remember. It's like somebody dreaming and hoping and praying for you, or like for y'all to cross paths or something like that. I'm hearing this song, you made me want to leave the one on it, start a new relationship with you. You make me, you make me, mm. why am I hearing it, what the hell? So you make somebody want to leave the person that they with, start a new relationship with you. Mm. Somebody feel like when they a uh, community came with you or something like they seeking out like um help like you somebody who gives like helpful advice you know what I'm saying they can come to you and they can get helpful advice. Mm. Okay, let's see. How do people? Man, why am I hearing this song? You are the only thing that matters matters to me. Oh, baby, 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 baby. Somebody want to save you. Somebody want to just take you and just um keep you to themselves. Not in no bad kind of way, but um you said hell no. Ain't nobody finna take me and, and, and keep me for themselves. We ain't finna do that. <laughs> nah, but, um, uh, yeah. Somebody feel like you're the only thing that matters to them, okay? Whether you know it or not. Well, 
What else? Let's see. How do people see you? <laughs> oh, look at that. You already know. So how do people how do people see you? I, I feel like this is what I'm saying. Like, I don't know, somebody could be psychic. Like if people feel like, man, this person they feel like you a psychic. And like, how the hell is this person a psychic or where the hell where this come from? Cause like back then they weren't doing none of that. You know what I'm saying? They was right here running with me in the trenches or whatever the fuck I've been doing. But you already know. I feel like you already know what how people see you. You already know how they view you. You already know what they thinking because you can probably read their mind or some shit or whatever. Whatever. That's just the dumbest thing to me though. People thinking that you can read their mind. Just spontaneously thinking that you can read their mind. So love me. People love you, bro. People love you. People love you. People want you to love them. <laughs> to be in your presence. So I want to start a family with you. So I'm getting like people shit. If somebody love you that much, they feel like they want they can start if somebody feel like they can start a family with you, then you must be the one, right? Are you the one girl? Are you the one boy? Are you the one? They feel like you the one. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that they, that they can um that they can bring home to their their mom or their pops or whoever you know what I'm saying if if it's, if you if that's the case then you the one baby because ain't no man or no woman um somebody coming for you I'm coming trust somebody's coming for you and then look I know you from somewhere it's like people know you when they see you they be like damn don't I know you from somewhere just like I told you my story when I uh you know when I gave a shout out to the uh the lovely the lovely young lady I seen at the store and she said huh, don't I know you from YouTube you know what I'm saying that like I look I'm serious I know you I know you from somewhere question mark it's like don't I know you from somewhere like then whatever you see you definitely could be um I'm in the spotlight some type of way. People know you. I'm telling you, people looking at you like, um, damn, you she a psychic or he a psychic? I'm telling you, that's what they doing. And somebody coming for you, they want you to know that, trust the, trust the know that somebody's coming for that ass. And they, they look, they want to start a family with you and they coming for you. However they coming, they, I don't know when they coming, but they coming. And they, they want you to choose them. I'm telling you, I, I want you. They, whoever this is, they definitely, they, somebody watching you. Whether you know it or not, then I I can't make it up. You are right. Then I said, somebody watching you. This is spirit telling me I'm right. Somebody watching you. You don't even see them watching you, but somebody literally adore you here. Would love me, I'm telling you. Then you are right. It's like you already know you are right. You already know how people view you, and you really don't give a damn if it's good or bad. You don't care because people gonna talk about you whether it's good, whether you're doing good or bad, right? You know what I'm saying? Mm. I'm telling you, somebody is look. <clears throat> I'm too afraid to talk to you. I just want you all the time. Okay, so yeah. Somebody's watching you, but they're afraid to say something to you. Whoever this person is, they're definitely afraid, but whatever. I mean, close mouth don't get fed. If you don't speak up, then shit, somebody else going to come along, you know what I'm saying? And they're going to sweep somebody, sweep you off your feet, or however, however this situation going to resonate. But ain't nobody got time to wait on nobody because you scared. If we go all grown, ain't no time. Ain't no time. Ain't no time for that. But somebody coming for you, man. They entrust and, and know that they coming. They definitely watching you. They afraid to say something. They watching you. They want to start a family with you. But, man, you can't even uh, get the... You don't even have the balls to even speak to me and say, hey. Or you just don't have the balls to speak to me, but you want to start a family with me. How about you speak to me first, come towards me first, and let me know what it is, what it like. Okay. I'm just saying. Let me see. I'm still hearing that song. You are the only thing that matters, matters to me. It's too many cars, y'all. I'm gonna take all these cards. Matter of fact, I'm gonna put them all back. Look at the bachelorette. 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 Look at the
I'm just saying, that's you right there. You the bachelorette. That, mm. Her to make friends. Well. Whoever you are, I feel like you are single the, with the bachelorette. Um, and you got here to make friends. So somebody definitely watching you, man. And somebody's here to make friends. Somebody want to make friends with you. Somebody feel like you are so beautiful. Well, that's how people think of you. It's somebody who's very beautiful. And there's definitely somebody here who wants to date you. But they're afraid to talk to you and speak up and say something to you. Um... And this, you know what I'm saying? That's that's what it is, and that's what it ain't. But people definitely very you very you like or send you out. Like I know you from somewhere. I know you from somewhere. I know you from, you know, so and so and so and so. And they're looking at you like, damn, this is psychic. Or people are intimidated by you because you are psychic or maybe they feel like you know about what happened in the past. You know what I'm saying? Whatever happened in the past, they feel like about you being a psychic, you know what role they played in it. So when they see you out, just like my situation, they don't even speak no more, really. They don't some of them don't say nothing. Some of them try to say something to just be to try to make it look like they chill, but they really not. You know what I'm saying? But Yeah. And I feel like it could be some people in your industry looking at you like they want you. You know what I'm saying? Um, very irresistible I'm also getting, but uh, very charming as well. It's like, um, to be honest, I'm hearing ding bat or, or ding bat or maybe they felt like you was a ding bat or you were dingy or you was like, you know, wasn't good enough or you wasn't never going to amount to anything. That's the energy I'm getting. But shit, now that shit, the motherfucker here to make friends now. You know what I'm saying? That's the energy now. But in the past, you had a lot of people around you. What is this past energy? Ooh. Past energy. I, listen. Famous. I can't make it up. I can't make it up. Whoever you are, you famous. That's why people looking at you like I know you from somewhere because you famous. That's why. Damn. Okay. Okay, let's see what's up with, what's up with this past energy. <clears throat> what's going on with this past energy? Are your ancestors here? Spirit said every dog has his day with this past energy. So whatever happened in the past with these enemies, they, they about to have their day. In the now, they about to have their day. Your ancestors came out. Whoever you are, you could have been molested as a child as well. <clears throat> somebody, look, still can't get you out, out their head. So somebody really, like, <laughs> they can't get you out their head. Somebody constantly thinking about you. And that's the truth, okay? I just think, um, and look, I want to work with you. So I don't know what this is you do for work. But whatever the other, you famous because of it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you could be a Virgo. Okay, we got YouTuber, so that's who you are. You're a YouTuber. Whoever you are, you're a YouTuber. You're a famous YouTuber. Okay, there you go. Thank you, Spirit. Whoever you are, you're a famous YouTuber. And, um, <laughs> that's why people be like, do I know you from somewhere? You know what I'm saying? Mm. I hear a beautiful soul. Famous YouTuber, but that's who you are. And if somebody wants to work with you. Okay? Somebody wants to work with you. But they may be afraid to talk to you or tell you, or this just might be somebody who wants to love on you, and they're afraid to talk to you and tell you, Okay? I keep saying that listening device. Something about a listening device. Okay, let me see. Let me. I'm gonna go, y'all. I gotta go. Let me see what sign you are. And I'm gonna let you go. Let me see what sign are you. Oops, oh, there's two in the car. That's a lot, though. That's a lot. Okay, well, I'm gonna take them. So we got Aries, <coughs> Moon. We got Tyrus, Virgo, Capricorn. 
these two, but these two reverse, and all of them upright. I'm just gonna put them back. In, oops, it's just so. Okay. It's like these cards. Just I feel like I can be talked to any sign. You could be a Leo, a Sun, a Libra. Okay. Earth sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, uh, Gemini, Virgo. Let's get one more. Two more. Give me two more spirits. Water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and a, and a Scorpio. Okay. <clears throat> so this ring could be for any of those signs or you, you could be any sign here you know but like I said with this past energy <clears throat> with this past energy spirit wants you know that every dog has his day okay you know they're saying every dog has his day so then nobody get away with nothing none of your enemies nobody let me get one more on these enemies I know I said I finna let y'all go but let me just get one more oh Seven swords. Can I get one more on this enemy? Damn, Luke will want to come out orchestrated by the government. So I'm gonna leave it. I'm gonna take it. Whatever this is, it's orchestrated by the government. It made me think of gang stalking and shit. You know what I'm saying? Truth teller. And then we got agent here. Friends helping her gang stalk you. So this with street crimes. There's too many cards. Stay next door to a pedophile. Okay, so I'm just gonna stop. Okay, so look, we got uh, orchestrated by the government. Whoever you are, okay, uh, you are you a truth teller. You work on YouTube. You're a famous YouTuber. You're a truth teller. So whatever you're doing on YouTube, you're definitely telling the truth. Whatever you're saying is definitely the truth. You're exposing something to do with street crimes. Okay, I don't know where they come from. Somebody need to hear that. Can't raise no man. He's already grown. What you gonna do? Can't Michelle. I needed to hear that. Friends helping her gang stalk you. So what was orchestrated by the government? Gang stalking was orchestrated by the government. You got some friends just helping whoever she is gang stalk you. So it wasn't her. Friends helping her gang stalk. It's a female energy, a karmic female that's gang stalking you. And whoever you are, like I said, you are you a YouTuber. Okay. Mm. Wow. Yep, you're a YouTuber. A YouTuber that's being gang stalked. Because you're a truth teller. Definitely could have been spare work involved in your situation. Okay. Okay, so. Hmm. Okay, y'all. Oh, so. Jeez. You have created a monster. Did I tell you? Then I tell you these listen, these people have created a monster when they came for you, whoever you are. Your ancestors ain't come to play. Your ancestors on somebody's ass right now as we speak, whoever you are, ma'am. Or sir, but I'm gonna say ma'am. Um some type of some. Then we got black magic sacrifice, so you a YouTuber. Somebody can get locked up, baby, for playing in your energy. I keep telling y'all. Somebody think get locked up. Neighborhood watch. So you could be under the neighborhood watch or your neighborhood is under watch, being watched, okay? And a lot of people finna get locked up that's in your neighborhood as well. I'm getting that too as well. And every dog has his day. These people that's playing your energy, they finna get locked up, okay? They some Obviously, you were sacrificed here. You, you some type of black man, you supposed to be sacrificed, but they, 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 they woke up. They look, they created a monster when they tried to do that to you because it didn't happen because you're too strong for one thing. It was never going to happen because you protected it. You see, your ancestors came out of your reading. This whole reading, out of every card that could have came out, your ancestors came out. So this just let me know this shit. Whoever you are, you you protected from whatever this black magic sacrifice was. Damn, on the bottom, on the black, on the back of the car, they got father. So I ain't even see that till I picked it back up. So maybe your father tried to sacrifice you. Did black magic on you and tried to sacrifice you? Okay, as well. So she is seven the swords. I'm telling you, mm, could be stalking your social media or stalking your your pay, your YouTube channel or whatever. It is. You protected though. Did I say that? You protected from whatever this seven the swords is or was. Okay, y'all, I'm going to let y'all go. I hope to help. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Make good choices. Bye.